Ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, they done it. Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody, stay calm. What's the so over the last few days, there's been some crazy news coming out of Disney, y'all. If you don't know what's going on, I'm gonna summarize it real quick for you. Disney and a bunch of the big dogs, they all had like an online meeting, and then the big Disney boss man, can't remember his name. We're just gonna call him the big man. He picked up a box, mate. Oh, you were the box. What was in the box? My man went in the box and pulled out a lightsaber hilt, y'all. Straight up. That that in itself is pretty sick, but. It gets crazy, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently, my man powered on the lightsaber and it literally, from inside the hill, shot out, mate, and powered on exactly like a real saber. And my man went a step beyond, y'all. He went up to the camera. Bear in mind, there's like a bunch of other people on like a Zoom meeting or whatever type of thing it was. But my man went right up to the camera and literally said, it's real. Ladies and gentlemen, the news is that Disney has actually made a real lightsaber. Now, first of all, I want to say I have no inside knowledge. I'm going off what people in the community have brought to me and like people that I trust have brought to me. I'm going off that stuff. All this stuff could be BS, y'all, so just take it with a grain of salt. Also, when I hear someone say that they have a real lightsaber, I think of this. In the escape. Obviously, it's not a real, real lightsaber. You can't just go outside and start cutting people down, y'all, even though I pretty much would love to do that, mate. However, I do have something semi-legitimate to show you guys. I say semi-legitimate because so many people have brought this to me. Apparently, you can literally go on Google and find it yourself. That's too hard for me. I like the lazy life. I just go off what other people have showed me. Check this out. What you're looking at is apparently a patented design that Disney have been working on for a long ass time. This ain't nothing new. They've been doing this for years. If you zoom into the picture, you can see like there's a bunch of mechanical parts. It's got turning gears. There's a bunch of crazy stuff, yo. This is the side angle. And I'm not going to lie from this angle. It's giving me the impression that if this is legit and they do design something like this, it's going to be really big, man. The third picture gives you like the biggest clear view of the motors inside and if you look towards the emitter on the right side, you can see the LED strips now. The next picture, this is the picture that's got everyone pretty much going crazy now. These LED strips, that's nothing new. That's what's inside your NeoPixel blade if you have a NeoPixel lightsaber. But in this picture, they're wrapping round the emitter and I'm assuming the motors, when they turn on, they shoot out of the blade and give you like an actual blade. It is crazy as that sounds. You can even see in the final picture, like the hilt's on the right, the blade's fully extended. I'm assuming the motors would, yeah, shoot the blade out, it would stop, it'd power on, and then go back inside the hilt. Going off those pictures, it looks doable, man. I'm not gonna lie, like, if you've got those big dollars, which you obviously know Disney has got, the big boy dollars. I'm not gonna lie, I could actually see this being a legitimate thing now with boundaries, and one of them being the hilt, it's gonna be some absolute Goliath, mate. I can't see you fitting all those mechanical pieces into something really sleek. It, I don't see that happening, mate. For me, that is where my boundaries end. I can't see it being some sleek saber. If it is, yeah, I'll put my hands up and say I was wrong, but I can't see it being some sleek thing, man. There's just no way. As for the LED blades, wrapping around the emitter, and you like power on the hilt, they shoot out, they obviously stop, power on, and then go back in. I could. In theory, I ain't a scientist or nothing, by the way. This is just a nerd is sitting in a chair, mate. But for me, I could see that working, but it ain't gonna be some sick thing, man. Like, I'd imagine the speed in which the blade ignites would be well slow, man. Like, you think you've got a parrot on, they got unravel, untwist, whatever you wanna call it, go to the top and power on. Even if they power on as they're going up, it's gonna be well flimsy, man. Like, the LED strip in a NeoPixel blade, it ain't some solid thing. Even if they've designed a way to like, when they unfold, they're solid. It's going to be well thin. They're going to like the blades from Rebels. Then they're going to go back in. It's going to be weird, man. Like, I can't see it, but I can see it, if that makes sense. However, the big one, ladies and gentlemen, and a few people have brought this to my attention. And again, all this is in the land of fantasy, as far as I'm concerned. Until I see it. Like, properly see it. It's fantasy, mate. It's on the same level as Lord of the Rings for me, yo. Even the photos, they do bring some sort of, like, real evidence to the argument of it, it being even real, should we say. But, again, until we see it in person, it's fantasy, man. But, yeah, back to what I was saying. A bunch of people came to me, and they have legit said, these sabers, they are not 
for the public to buy. They're actually for the people who work in the Disney parks. Apparently it's for the hotel. I don't know if that bit's true, but it makes sense. They've just built the Avengers Stadium thing. That, that massive complex, you must have seen it on the news. If you ain't, check it out. It is absolutely massive, yo. Like Disney, big time. But what I've heard, only the people who work in the hotel or work in the parks they're going to have this crazy lightsaber. They're going to do it for the shows, like for the pictures, all that stuff. You know, if you go to Disneyland and you see like people dressed up as Rey, Kylo Ren, they're going to have these like prototype sabers. Again, I don't know how true this is. It's, I'm only literally going off what I've been told. I have no genuine evidence. So take this entire video with a grain of salt. I know a bunch of people are like, yo, my man's just made a real lightsaber. <laughs> However, if Disney come out one day and they say, look what we've got and it's sleek and you power it on and it shoots out exactly like a NeoPixel lightsaber in the same speed and the blade looks thick and full and just real, I'll be like gassed, mate. I think everyone in the lightsaber community will be like, I don't know, mate. We'll be going Super Saiyan levels of screaming, mate. That would be the dream, the hype. Ladies and gentlemen, are you excited? What do you think of the news? Do you think it's genuine? Do you think it's just for part members? What do you think? I'm genuinely curious. Please let us all know down below. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Big up the lightsaber community. I'll see you in a bit.